Well, a very, very warm welcome to you on what is, of course, a truly special day in this part of the world. It is Derby Day, a rivalry so deeply entrenched into the history of sport in this land. It divides opinions, it divides families, it divides just about anything that can be divided. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. This is a friendly, but a friendly only in name. Well, exhibition match sounds like an easy ozy game of football, Peter, and a picture-perfect occasion until the word pride gets a mention. And it's likely to have quite a big say between teams that could easily be sucked into an excuse for another feud. Why let an exhibition match get in the way of that? So these two will be going at it very, very strongly. So we're up and running. Hoists it forward. And it's Livermore. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And now the breakaway. Al Ghazi. He's had that big chance! Oh, he's really drilled it. The keeper felt he had that covered. Some of the crowd were less convinced. It was really well drilled. Grealish. Means. Barkley. And he's there to cut it out. Ivanovic did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. He's through. And he's straight offside. And here's Al Ghazi. It's a loose ball. Let us put a stop to that. And it's played forward. Al Ghazi. It's on a plate, goes for goal! He's missed, but by that far... A more than decent attempt, Peter. Barkley. So it is still nil-nil. And that's one way to annoy his teammates. Livermore. Forward it goes. Livermore. It's Grant! Oh, 
extraordinary. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. Barkley. And here's Al Ghazi. Good take, and he goes for goal! And he's done it! His position was perfect, the invitation was there for him, and his response absolutely clinical. That's just a great finish, but it's down to very clever movement. You can see this has been obviously worked on on the training ground. He knew exactly where he wanted the ball, and it all came good. A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Crunching tackle. Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Phillips. Tries a shot! Has a hit! Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. It's Al Ghazi. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Grant. Oh, he's caught him there. It's a free kick. A heavy challenge. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. He gets past his man. Beautifully done. Barkley! Oh, that is rather wayward. Aston Villa are looking quite mean on the counter, and combating that requires even more meanness. Up to half time, leading, and things are looking pretty good. Phillips. Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1 0. Has a pop! Oh, that's a waste. Greenish plays it forward. Gets it upfield. And it's Phillips. He's left his man. Going through. Top from the keeper. 
Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Tries to get it clear. Now it's Grealish. Al Ghazi. It's Al Ghazi! Oh, brilliant! That is brilliant! About as smooth as it gets. And there's the goal they've been looking for. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. So that's... And the half-time whistle goes. What do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can... ...operated by goals, and two between them at half-time. And we are already promptly back on the way. Target. Grealish. Target. Al Ghazi. Barkley. Just brushed off the ball there. And now they can launch a counter. He's got away. What a ball this is to... He's gone for it! Sticks it away! The second half off to a spectacular start! West Bromwich are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. We have got ourselves a game here. A scoring early in this half just takes the pressure off now and allows them a chance to be a bit more patient in trying to level things up. He spotted the run and played him through. Shapes to shoot! You know, thinking about that, I think they perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. We have ourselves a real game here. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming.
Brzezinski cuts it out. Tries to get it forward quickly. Barkley. And here's Grealish. And here's Al Ghazi. Referee has just said play on. And here's Grealish. And the finish! Lingered over it, and the chance to counter had gone. Well, the whole idea of a good breakaway is to leave the opposition struggling to get back, and they were just too slow. So here comes the substitution. Well, the referee's seen the board, and he's got to allow a double... And it's played forward. Brought forward. What does he try from here? And it's Phillips. Looks to thread it through. Plenty waiting in the middle. Plays it back. Now it's off. That's a hit! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. <laughs> he and the whistle has gone for a reckless challenge there. Austin. And it's Triore. It's a fat. He's gone for it! Great leap! He's oh, enough try. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work though. Austin, Grant. Chance! It's broken loose. Another big chance that gets away. This is proving to be a very good spell. The intensity is great, but uh, they've got to make it count. Away from immediate danger. That'll be a throw in. And there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. So we. It's come loose. And he's been booked for simulation. Listen, he can play the innocent as much as he wants, Peter, but it was fairly obvious to everyone here. He's got no hiding place. Target. Grealish. 
Good ball. It has got... Has a goal! He scored! And again they hit the front. Speed of thought, efficiency of movement and certainty of outcome. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. And when the manager called on him, he was only too happy to repay that faith. Well, the instruction from the manager would have been go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal. Mission accomplished. So we have a breakthrough, now how will things develop from here? Oh, it was a long time coming, but I think it's fully merited. They've applied themselves extremely well. And here's Austin, chipped through. That's a pop! Should have equalised. Makes you think, Peter, they could have been doing this earlier. Still, it's encouraging. Mings. Almost there, and the players can feel it. Oh, it's a searing run. He is a man on a mission. Plays it out to the wing. And it's Grealish. Finds himself eased off the ball. Look, their supporters must be going barmy about this because there's no sense of purpose in what we're seeing. Deep into stoppage time. Gets wrestled off the ball. He's been bundled over, that is a foul. Now this is a potential flashpoint, and the referee has his hands full. Goalkeeper's <laughs> ball. And there goes the final whistle. Well, whatever the shortcomings on either side, it was a great game to watch. Just one between them. Well, how will we look back on that? Aston Villa made their intentions clear that nothing else...